Are you ready to zip across Lagos mega city, leaving gridlock behind to never worry about traffic and arrive at your destination in half the time? That's the promise of the Lagos Red Line Rail project, a monumental undertaking that's about to change the face of transportation in this mega city. Sadly, this rail project seems to be delayed. Or do you think it's already abandoned? I don't think so. If you want to get the latest updates and developments about the Lagos Rail Mass Transit, particularly the Red Line and Bishops project, this is the video for you. We went underground, inspected the stations, and in this video, we'll spill the beans. So buckle up, Lagos, because the Red Line Express is coming soon. Kindly hit that subscribe button to never miss an update about the Lagos Blue and Red Line projects. Let's begin with some facts, then the latest updates. The Red Line is a 37km route through Lagos, connecting Abado to Marina. It will have eight major state-of-the-art stations, each one a modern beacon of efficiency. On November 5, 2023, the governor of Lagos State, Babajide Songwonu, commissioned the Oimbo flyover. This T-shaped flyover with a total length of 630 meters is an important bridge connecting the Oimbo station of the Lagos Red Line to the Oimbo bus station. The Oyimbo flyover serves as a major transit link between Lagos Island and the mainland, ascending from Motala Mohammed Way in Ebutameta and dropping traffic into two separate arterial roads, Ido and Kostain. Interestingly, Yaba and Ikeja train stations are taking shape, and even the mighty bridges are soaring skywards. These bridges, like the recently inaugurated Ikeja overpass, ensure smooth traffic flow, freeing cars and trains to whiz by without a hitch. Hold your breath, Lagos, because the engines are warming up. Test runs are set to begin in the first quarter of 2024, a crucial step towards the grand launch. Remember those sleek red trains you might have seen as you commute to work in Lagos? They are getting prepped and polished, ready to whisk you away at super speeds. Trust me, you could leave Abado and reach Marina in a mere 30 minutes, a dream come true for many weary commuters. This mega project doesn't just magically appear, it takes muzzle. And in this case, it takes money, and a lot of it. The Lagos State Government is working tirelessly with a team of financial titans, securing the necessary funds to keep the Red Line project going. Several local and international banks are also lending a helping hand, ensuring this dream doesn't get derailed by financial hurdles. Remember, even the best plans need a little fine-tuning. The Red Line's route has seen some adjustments, not on a whim, but based on expert advice and the needs of Lagosians. The red light isn't just about trains and tracks, it's about transforming Lagos. You could finally say goodbye to endless traffic jams and pollution-chopped Lagos streets, especially in the mainland. This is a breath of fresh air for a city grasping for efficient movements. A large percentage of the 15 million Lagosians will finally have a reliable, affordable and eco-friendly way to get around. The red light is more than just a railway, it's a bridge to a better future for Lagos. The Blue Line Rail is already solving huge problems of commuting within Lagos metro areas. Imagine the impact of the Red Line. No mega project is without heat bombs. The main challenge right now is completing the stations and getting them ready for use. But don't worry, the Lagos State Government is lesser focused on closing the gap. They are working day and night to begin operation and to ensure that the Red Line becomes a complete reality. The Red Line is a symbol of hope, a testament to Lagos' resilience and ambition. But its success depends on all of us. We can make the red line a dream come true by embracing it, using it responsibly, and spreading awareness about its transformative power. Be part of the red line generation, the generation that rode the wave of change and ushered in a new era of mobility for Lagos. So there you have it, the red line is more than just a project, it's a promise kept, a promise of a better tomorrow, where committing is a breeze, air is cleaner, and time is precious. Hold on to that excitement because the red line is about to change the very way we move in this incredible city. Stay tuned, Lagos, because the countdown has begun. Kindly hit the subscribe button and like this video to spread it across to other people, Lagosians and Nigerians and Africa as a whole, who might be interested. I will see you in the next video.